Karen Bryant for MMA Heat. I'm here with BJ Penn, and I have to say, you're the person I get the request for the most in terms of, can you please interview BJ? So I know a lot of people are going to be very happy about this. But I want to know how you're feeling about Nick as an opponent in terms of how challenging he would be for you. Uh, Nick's a great opponent. You know, um, his, uh, his size, his, his height, his length is going to... Uh, uh, pose challenges for me when I step in there. Of course, uh, we know he's great on the ground. He's always in, comes in great shape. So, you know, it's, it's going to be a tough fight. I'm, I'm sure it's going to be, uh, you know, one of the best people I've ever been in the ring with. But, uh, you know, we're here to win the fight. Can you take us through the, the day or afternoon when you heard that you were elevated to main event and even when the whole thing got mixed around that you were going to be fighting Nick in the first place? Uh, I, I didn't find out till uh, no, I was pretty surprised that, uh, that the uh, I, I wasn't fighting Carlos Condit and, and that I was fighting Nick Diaz uh, when that finally all got put together and then when I ended up becoming a main event I was uh, pretty happy yeah. you know it's it's good to uh, it's good to main event as many fights as you can in your career and, and I've had I, and I've been blessed and, and with the opportunity to main event um, a few uh, UFC's especially big ones like this so it's, it's all positive very nice. And the thing is, is he said that he wasn't really looking forward to fighting you in terms of the fact that you know each other, you used to train together. Can you tell us how much you did in fact train together? Yeah, no, uh, we no, we train together, we spar together, we grapple together, you know, so, uh, you know, I'm sure we know some of the things we do, but, you know, fight's a fight and, you know, everything changes. I, that's, that's two years ago and I don't know what he's going to come at me with and... You know, all I know is from 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 any tapes that I've that I've watched of him. That's all. That's all I can gather any information from there. Well, he's a pretty good boxer. He's a very good boxer, without a doubt. Um, that's uh, that's something that uh, we've we've been uh, we've been uh, preparing for, and uh, we expect we expect him to come at us with his boxing ability. A lot of people talk about Nick in terms of him not showing up for things or that he might be unreliable or this or that, but you have had to deal with the tumultuous pre, you know, leading up to this as well. So how's it been for you just coming into this fight and, and all things that have gone on? How do you keep your peace in camp? Um, no, I'm, I'm just, I take it as it comes. I'm just happy to be here. You know, um, like I said, I'm just a kid from a small town. I'm just happy to be in the UFC and, and, and I feel like I've, uh, I feel like I've uh, made it already in that sense. And you're keeping working with the same guys. I know Jason Perillo is back, uh, or, or is with you working on the boxing. Have you had pretty much the same guys? And if so, why did you aspire to that theory? You know, um, I, you know, I've had um, different people over the years, but kind of always in the same group. And um, you know, I, I stick around the same guys uh, because I think it's it's the energy. You know, we'll go and uh, outsource and bring new sparring partners in and. You know, new people in to uh, show us different techniques or give us different strategies. But uh, I think it's the people you build uh, energy in and you build confidence in uh, for, with them um, around you. You said you have a love-hate relationship with MMA. How are you feeling about it right now? And <laughs> hopefully you're loving it and going to stick around? I love mixed martial arts as of right now. That's a good answer. Now, I know also you're a Hawaii boy. Can you make a good fish taco? Uh, fish taco. I, I can make a pretty good regular taco. <laughs> good burrito. <laughs> nice, very nice. Well, thank you for talking with me and good luck to you. Thank you.